Hi, how's it going? My name's Matt and welcome back to the Boho Family Adventure where we are moving from a nine to five to living outside all the time in our van. Savannah, say hello Savannah. No. Um, this is the story of us moving away from working all the time. Myself, my fiance and my daughter, Tyler and Indy. You will meet them eventually. Um, and this is just kind of like the van build section. So what's kind of happening, what we're doing, what work we've got going on until we get to what we call the big day where we're sitting in the front of the van. We're going that way and we just head off. Uh, first stop is going to be Europe, which is going to be insane. <laughs> um, and then wherever the wind blows, really. So we wanted to take you on our journey and show you what we're doing, whether that's right or wrong. Um, give you some tips on some bits and bobs we've done. Um, show you what we're doing to make it a home on wheels rather than just a van. So this is part two, or as I'm calling it, episode two. And uh, today we are going to be doing some pretty boring stuff, really. So first off, I have this clip, which I need to fit to the diesel heater for the pipe. And then I'm going to crank it up full because it's absolutely freezing. And then I'm going to fit these little look, cigarette lighter and whoop, a USB, which we're going to be running from our light panel through the back. So when we open the back door and hang the shower up, we can plug the 12 volt shower in. And there's a couple of extra ports down there for charging phones and things like that through the night. So yeah, that's it, really. Nothing too exciting. I just wanted to make sure I made videos regularly keep you updated on uh kind of what's going on in our world and uh oh hello i swear every time i turn this camera on somebody walks past and i'm just trying to think if there's anything else i can be doing i'll show you some of the bits anyway of, of what's going on and i'll try and film it as as best as i can it's a bit dark at, in here today even with the even if you put the lights on it's still a bit not not great um oh say hello again I might have to put the window dark black thing up, block people out. Filming, no, I can't do that. Uh, anyway, um, a little bit more of the plans we have. Yes, let's talk about the plans we have. So I've got some more foil to put over, the foil and panning to put over the, uh, the metal in the back of the doors. Um, if I've got time, I might do that today, actually. Um, I'd like to get some put onto here uh, to carpet it or uh, maybe even plywood over the door but it just depends uh, on kind of money and time and uh, to give you an idea of time today is the 25th of February we want to be gone by the 12th of April so a couple of months ish to get stuff done and to make this perfect in in every way for us um, and then just get it to the stage where we can just tweak it as we go. Um, we've got some more woodwork being done in a few weeks, which will put up a cupboard above the window, which we're doing like this thing with some bread bins, some wooden bread bins to make them like little cabinets. Um, we're going to get some wooden panels put along the top and hopefully come down onto the side panels as well to kind of make it a bit more of a right angle and hide all this good stuff at the back i'm not sure how we're gonna cover this section up yet uh any ideas please let me know in the comments of how we can uh we can get that hidden without uh without losing the shape of the van if that makes sense as well um and then i think that's about it there's gonna be lots of questions which i'm gonna be asking so it'll be great if you guys can jump in the comments below now a big thank you by the way to people who've already commented and people who have watched the video, um, it's really good that we've got this platform, not just to share with other van life people and people thinking of doing their own builds on vans, but also as a place where friends and family um, can, can kind of keep in touch with us, monitor what we're doing and, and kind of live, live the van life through us. And as I mentioned in the previous video, I'm now on the timer. So I've got 31 working days left and then I have no full-time job. 
which we'll have a talk about in more depth of how we're going to fund van life and and the, the work we're going to be doing kind of through winter through summer and things like that so anyway i feel like i'm just rambling on at you at this point so as a quick reminder i'm going to fit this i'm going to try and fit these and i'm going to put some foil and stuff up there but we'll do a time lapse and you can watch it and we'll catch up later on wish me luck So, uh, I think it's a good job. Things are working. Uh, I just need to tidy a few wires up um, and work out what I'm going to do with the cable that is there for when we open the door. I'm probably just going to get some surround for it uh, and just kind of let it let it hang. Like it's not it's not in the way or anything. Um, so, the reason that's there is so we can plug the two phone chargers in at night time. It's going to be a little shelf, hopefully, which the phones can sit on. But then also there is a 12 volt adapter at the back where we can plug in our shower which will go next to it and uh fingers crossed we will have an outdoor shower as well i think that's it for today i think that's a win-win apart from uh, a little plaster needed but yeah overall not a bad job i hope it's all fused up twice um and everything seems to be working it's all on the switches on the main panel now as well so I think that is it for today's episode of the Boho Family Adventure. Season one, episode two. It's now getting really dark. Really <laughs> looks like it's going to hammer it down. So I'm going to go inside. I'm going to go and play with the little one, with, the, with Indy, with Ricardo. We've got, some, we've got friends over as well. Hello, Tracy, if you're watching this. I'm going to have a beer. feel like I've earned it. And... Uh, I'll be back when I've got another job to do. If not, it'll be when we get some more woodwork put in. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing and liking, sharing, commenting and all that kind of thing. All I can say is there's loads more to come with plenty more adventures. This is kind of the boring part at the minute. We've got loads of stuff going on over the next two years, three years, who knows. Um, but I would like to say thank you. And if you don't mind, I'm going to drop you a little question at the bottom for those who've been around, those who've travelled and those who've got about is our first stop is going to be France when we go over to Europe. Now it's going to be a bit of a whistle stop tour because we've got to get to Portugal pretty quickly, but we are looking for places to stay around the coast of France. If you have any places, if you've been anywhere in France or you can recommend some fantastic places, sites or camps, anything at all in that area, please Put some comments below. Follow us on Instagram, boho underscore family underscore adventure. Drop us some comments on there as well. And uh, if you can give us some advice on where we can stay, that'd be great. Thank you so much. I'm going to go and get a beer. Safe journey. Happy travels. Watch how you go. I've been Matt. This is the Boho Family Adventure. And I will see you soon.